Welcome to Kettler's pregame. I'm Matt Schneidman here with pitcher Trey Wingenter. Now, Trey, these last two games you've really been on in your starts. What's been working for you, and do you really feel yourself kind of building momentum going forward? Well, I've just tried to you know get going right away, right off the bat, and uh, get ahead of hitters and uh, work fast, keep the pace going, and that's uh, I think that's really helped our defensive players. They've been playing really well behind me, and they're staying in the game. And uh, I've just tried to keep uh, you know working as fast as I can to keep them locked in and re you know ready to go. And, you know, going forward, I mean, this team hasn't always been as great as they were defensively yesterday. How much confidence does that give a pitcher when your team is that good as they were yesterday behind you? Oh, it's a huge bonus. It's great. I mean, it's you can't ask for anything else than playing solid defense behind you. And they've been doing that, you know, every time I've been out lately. And we know Coach sometimes has a short lease with you guys. Does he tell you before a game he's going to keep you in until a certain situation or a certain pitch count or just based on the day? He just kind of feels it out once the game gets going, you know. And, uh... You know, yesterday was just a day where he felt like it was a good time with the lefty up to go to Logan out of the pen, and, you know, it worked out for us. So. Mm -hmm. And I know we've got some mustaches growing in the bullpen, yeah. most notably Wit and Bazaar. If you had to pick one, which one is the best? Oh, I'd, I'd have to go Bazaar at this point just because of, you know, the mustache just, just goes with everything else that, that he's about. He's a big dude, kind of scary, creepy-looking kind of guy with that mustache. It's, it's pretty special. Absolutely. And we know you've given a shout-out to Vince Fiore on the air for his Twitter handle. Is there anyone that's a must-follow on this team? I think JT, but anyone in your mind? Oh, JT's definitely a great follow. And, uh, yeah, I'd have to say JT would be the, the, mo the most – the guy that you would want to follow the most on this squad. Absolutely. Well, for Kettler's pregame alongside Trey Wingenter, I'm Matt Schneidman.